Today we're going to use Taggle, but we're going to um, put a custom image in and it's going to be our name. So I opened up Paint and now I'm going to type my name and I'm going to make it an image. So click the um, A for text and then type your name in. Now this is awfully small and so I'm going to highlight it and I'm going to first I'm going to change the um, font because there's some really nice fonts some fun fonts you can do um, any kind of font you want so here's one this one's interesting okay so I have that but it's still awfully small so I'm going to go over here and I'm going to go all the way down to 72 now as you can see it disappeared so I'm going to take the edge make it bigger but you know what that's still not big enough so I'm going to make it I'm going to click in there, I'm going to make it 200, see what happens. Oops, That's pretty good, maybe a little bit bigger. But you can make it, just make sure it's pretty big, but you can make it any size you want to. And I think I'll make it bold. Okay, so that looks pretty good. But now I have to save it. So I'm going to go up to File and then I'm going to go down to Save As, and I'm going to ask you to save it as a JPEG right there. So it, once again, it was File, Save As, and JPEG. So I'm saving mine on the desktop. You can save yours anywhere just so that you know where it is. Okay, I have a lot of locations. If I didn't know where it was going, it would be hard. So then I'm just going to type my name um, and save. Okay, now I'm going to open up um, a web browser and go to Taggle and I'm already logged in but if you need to log in log in with Google and click get started and create new word cloud now I um, I don't have any words but so I'm, I'll just put in a few words Okay, so here's my list, and I just put in things that I like to do, and, and my niece and nephew, and my birthday's coming up. So I just put in words that describe me, and I'm going to click Import Words. So now there they are, and I'm going to make mine, my name bigger. I don't know. 20. Okay, so now I'm going to click Visualize, and it just came up like that. However, let's go to Shapes and Add Image, and I'm going to go get my name off the desktop. And you can play around with the edges if you want to see if you can sharpen the edges up a little. You can also switch it, um, but I'm going to leave it just like that and click OK and now I'm using this one and I'll click visualize and there's my name with my name and remember you can change um, colors and use shape color it'll all come out black and white so use any colors you want to use then when you're completely done you're going to click download and share Remember, download it right here, and I'm going to put it someplace once again where I know where it's at, and I'm going to hit save. I'm going to log into Google Classroom, and then I'm going to ask you to drag this, open the assignment, and drag this into um, the assignment. So you're going to click add and then drag that. If you need help, just raise.